I need so we gotta take these guys out. He knows what madness my father intends. There we go. There's one. Who's the other officer? What the fuck? Oh god. Okay, there's one up here. Let's just go get this one. There we go. You don't expect me? Really? Fine then. God dang it. The other ones were e so much easier. Well, not the other ones. The other one, I should say. the hell I countered that reloading this oh man shoot well that sucked I didn't mean to hit that guy There we go, Jesus. That was that was the worst fighting I've had in a while. A kill streak? I didn't know there's kill streaks in this game. What is this? Call of Duty? D. What has Church done with the cargo? Go back over here, I suppose. So here we are, face to face at last, my friend. It's been quite an adventure, let me tell you. Let me tell you, working my way through your nasty little tricks and traps. Clever, some of them anyway. I'll give you credit for that. Came here for a reason. Different reasons, it seems. <laughs> Where are the supplies you stole? I, I guess I put him on my ris his, his misery. Yeah, well, I guess here we go. I ask again, where are the supplies? <laughs> on the island beyond there. A waiting pickup. But you've no right to it. It isn't yours. No, not mine. Those supplies are meant for men and women who believe in something bigger than themselves. Who fight and die that one day they might be free from tyranny such as yours. <laughs> are these the same men and women who fight with muskets forged from British steel? Who bind their wounds with bandages sewn by British hands? How convenient for them. We do the work. They reap the rewards. You spin a story to excuse your crimes. As though you're the innocent one and they the thieves. It's all a matter of perspective. There is no single path through life that's right and fair and does no harm. Do you truly think the crown has no cause? No right to feel betrayed? You should know better than this. Dedicated as you are to fighting Templars, who themselves see their work as just. Think of that the next time you insist your work alone befits the greater good. Your enemy would beg to differ. And would not be.
Zawanios kina, ik zie jij net de kant uit die toekaske. Passing was a boon for us both. Come on. I expect you'll want my help retrieving everything from the island. I have been reunited with my father, but I do not yet know if this bodes well or ill. Our goals are aligned, at least so far as independence is concerned. But he continues to defend Charles Lee, the man who murdered my mother and burned my village. Still, he makes a point about Washington and those who back him. I hear much talk of freedom and equality. But it seems one must be a landed white man to benefit. What if someone like me? Or Suri? What role for us in this new world? Is my father right then? There is so much I must consider and so little time in which to do it. Welcome back. And how was Martinique? Achilles, I... I owe you an apology. It was wrong of me to say the things I did. Your words were harsh, Connor. But there was also truth there. I failed the order, allowed the Templars to take control. But now their hold is weakened, which makes me believe there's a chance for peace. Imagine what might be accomplished if we were to unite. Why the change of heart? Where is this coming from? You've met your father, haven't you? I do not claim to trust the man or even like him. But I would be remiss to ignore this opportunity. Atham may listen, but will he understand? And even if he does, will he agree? Even he must admit that we can achieve more together than we do alone. I assume you're off to find him. Yes. I ride for New York to see what might be done. Okay. We're finally over here. In New York, with my pops. We need to know what the Loyalists are planning, if we're to put an end to this. I've tried, but the soldiers themselves are told nothing now, only to await orders from above. Keep digging. Come find me when you have something worth sharing. We're so close to victory. A few more well-placed attacks and we'll be able to... Put an end to the civil war and be rid of the crown. What do you intend? Well, nothing at the moment, since we're completely in the dark. I thought the Templars had eyes and ears everywhere. Oh, we did. Until you started cutting them off. Your contact said orders from above. It tells us exactly what we need to do. Track down the Loyalist commanders. Man, I always have to follow my dad. I'd hate to do this as an adult. Follow my dad everywhere. Get the hell out of there! I like how it's all of a sudden night and raining. It'd be cool for like, like if at night, if um, well not at, at night, but like if in the game, if you're close to say your dad or something like that, it would slowly start like becoming you know, you know, evening and that. So then it's not kind of a weird transition or I don't know, just something simple. That's just my thought. But I'm not going to complain too much about it. In fact, I'm done about it. But... Oh, I always got to follow my dad. 
See, he does all these awkward moves. It's like, man, tell me where you're going. Oh, I'm sorry, Dad. I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to do it. It's a mistake. Holy crap. Oh, get up. Have you considered the proposal? I'm unconvinced. To reinforce them would leave New York exposed. It's hard enough maintaining order with our current numbers. Cut in half. Yet if we do not join with them, they risk defeat. And then what? Well, they should have come by sea. Oh, talking in circles. We're nothing watching as we are. Then what do you propose we do? March in there and demand answers? Well, yes. <laughs> Connor? Little help here? No, you didn't help me last time. In fact, you ran away well because it was your freaking fault. Alive, oh, I, I meant to air freaking attack someone. Now I gotta do this. Look, I didn't even mean to freaking jump that. You know what? I'm gonna make sure I don't I don't get attacked from here. Good, that didn't hurt. There we go. Oh, Dad, I almost hit you. Oh my God. Oh, what as if? Oh, man. There we go. Come on, you big fucking kilt. Come on. Is this guy still alive? Okay, no, he's not. Oh man, I, I meant to use them as, as a human shield. Screw it, let's kill these guys. We'll bring them back to my quarters at Fort George and see what secrets they might share. Really? Well, you'd best get after him, then. You go. I will watch the prisoners. No, you do it. Why me? Because I said so. Now go. <sighs> I'm seriously so sick of his attitude. Dad, seriously. Well, what the fuck is this? Here we go, here we go, here we go. Here we go, there we go. Oh my god, I didn't think I'd make it. Tell you anything you want. Anything. Only don't make We just have some there. questions for you. Cross that threshold, and I'm a dead man. There you are, Connor. I was worried you might have gotten lost. Come along, then. Oh, 
I gotta beat him up. Okay, gotta push him. Come on, man. Hurry up. Keep going. I don't want to pull this trigger, man. Don't make me pull this trigger. I love, oh, I miss pushing him. I look like a douche now. Keep going up the stairs. Look at that. I missed again. Now he's going to stop. Look. I'm the worst freaking pusher around. Oh my god. Look at this. What are the British planning? To march from Philadelphia. That city's finished. New York's the key. They'll double our numbers, push back the rebels. When do they begin? Two days from now. June 18th. I must warn Washington. You see? That wasn't so very difficult now, was it? Uh, I've told He's you gonna kill him. Just watch. Now let me go. Of course. The other two said the same. It must be true. You killed him. You killed all of them. Why? They'd have warned the loyalists. You could have held them until the fight was done. What? And with precious time and money on their care? What would be the point? They'd given up everything they knew. I'll meet you at Valley Forge. Why don't we go together? Like, why does he have to separate from me all the time? For all your fishing needs, come to Captain Hornbill. Whether a fleet or a weekend angler, he's got everything to make him jump out of the water. Yeah, I'll meet you guys there. <laughs> it's fast traveling time and everything. Alrighty, we finally caught up with our dad, who for some reason never wants to be with me until we should be sharing what we know with a certain location. You seem to think I favor him, but my enemy is a notion, not a nation. It is wrong to compel obedience, whether to the British crown or the Templar cross. And I hope in time the loyalists will see this too, for they are also victims. You oppose tyranny, injustice. These are just symptoms. Their true cause is human weakness. Why do you think I keep on trying to show you the error of your way? You have said much, yes. But you have shown me nothing. Then we'll have to remedy that, then, won't we? Sir. Hello, Connor. What brings you here? The British have recalled their men in Philadelphia. They march for New York. Very well. I'll move our forces to Monmouth. If we can rout them, we'll have finally turned the tide. And what's this? Private correspondence. Oh, of course it is. Would you like to know what it says, Connor? It seems your good friend here has just ordered an attack on your village. Although attack might be putting it mildly. Well, tell him, Commander. We've been receiving reports of Allied natives working with the British. I've asked my men to put a stop to it. By burning their villages and salting the land, by calling for their extermination, according to this letter. Not the first time, either. Tell them what you did 14 years ago. That was another time. The Seven Years' War. And so now you see what happens to this great man when under duress. He makes excuses, displaces blame, does a great many things, in fact, except take responsibility! No! Who did what and why must wait? My people come first. Then let's be off. No. You and I are finished. Son. Do you think me so soft that by calling me son, I might change my mind? How long did you sit on this information, or am I to believe you discovered it now? My mother's blood may stain another's hands, but Charles Lee is no less a monster, and all he does, he does by your command. 
A warning to you both. Choose to follow me or oppose me, and I will kill you. Damn. I got some balls. Don't touch the ground. Reach the old growth forest. Like, don't touch the ground as in don't get off my horse? I can attempt that. How far this is, though, that depends. Oh, God. Stop Patriot Messengers with the time limit. Two, three minutes. Oh, my God. See, the horses jump over the most ridiculous stuff ever. Oh, man, I freaking hate horses. What the hell is this? How am I not supposed to touch the ground? Well, I guess I could have shot him, but still. Well, let's get on this horse. But I don't, I don't, I don't like using my gun. My gun's lame. Giddy up! See, look, this is exactly why I hate the horses. didn't want to turn on that fucking log. Okay, let's go, buddy. Don't stop either. Really? Oh, man. Really? Come on! Oh man. Fucking horses! Get the fuck out of the way! There you go. Hmm. There we go. Jesus. Is that guy not dead? I don't know. Screw him. I thought that was a messenger. Keep going. Approach the fort. Horses, stop, please. You got, why you gotta jump over freaking rocks? It just, just slows us down. Right here. How are you supposed to do this without? I should make sure the village is safe. How was I supposed to do that when no, without touching the ground? That's ridiculous. Alrighty, let's go. And can't do that. Is there someone behind me? the hell is this back here? Is he not dead? <laughs> what do I do? Just... Okay, that's awkward. Okay, I'll meet you guys back in the village. This is... This is weird. This is just straight up weird.
Home again, home again. Jiggity jig. Oh man, they do, they have muskets now. Have they really been talking with the French? Or not the French, the, the British? Charles Lee. Luana <laughs> Ah, <sighs> now I gotta go prevent this too now, don't I? Or whatever the hell we're doing. Whoa, what the hell was that? Neutralize the warriors. Do I? I don't have to kill him, do I? I'm sorry, brother. I can't have you do this. I'm sorry. Four more. <laughs> that was awesome. I'm just gonna tackle him from now on. That's that was the coolest method yet. Excuse me. One more up here. It looks like. go I don't want to kill him. Please don't make me kill him. Oh, man, are you serious? Yo, Tena. That is a dance. It's a good hit stone. Redden I gave him. Charles Lee. Mountmouth. Was that the hardship? I saw one out to Marse. Is in a hold on Patriot. When I did what you need. Draw a saga. I saw one out to Marse. Oh, Doc, thank you. Come on, dear Dio. Runo Dio, how to quen you. I'm going to go to Summa. Oh, dear, the num start to get. Ewe, they are no one to tango yat the no star to me. Ona was a derisa in Jadaro. 